Hello everybody and welcome back to our Fallout 3 playthrough. I'm your host Alan 4, you find us where we left off in the last episode. We'd just come out of the steelworks, steel yard, we picked up a number of um, steel bars and we are back here. I haven't got much in the way of ammo or much of anything really because uh, all of our equipment was taken when we first arrived here and now I have to head back and talk to Medea, apparently. Werner isn't going to fit. Hey, not so loud. The bosses can't see what I'm up to over here. Uh, why shouldn't I tell them what you're up to? Why would you? They'll probably thank you for the information with a bullet to the head. They don't give a rat's ass about you. Oh, okay, whatever. Don't know what we were doing there. Rotary press turn. Emergency stop. Hmm. Okay, that's interesting. I'll remember that for next time. Got nothing to say to you. All right, are you gonna let me out or? No scabs near the gate. Back off. No scabs near the gate. Back off. <laughs> okay. Well, I do now have a gun. I don't think I've got much in the way of healing items and... Well, this is a dead end. Brilliant. Uh, well, I don't really know where I'm supposed to be heading now. I came from the steel yard, so... <laughs> She's got a mini nuke bra on. Oh. <gasps> Ammo press. What do you mean access denied? Wait. You're new, aren't you? Are you here from the Maybe he can make me some ammo. The capital wasteland. Ronto? Where's home? Um, why do you want to know? Well, since you might be able to help me, I'll let you in on a little secret. The slaves are always planning all sorts of things. I find out what's going on and let the bosses know, and they let me shrug off some of the work detail. Good deal, huh? If you hear anything, you should let me know. Okay, we'll do. Uh, What's new? Have you heard anything? No, no, I need a uh, weapon. I'm here to find a cure for the mutations. Marco is making weapons. I haven't heard of hmm. Yeah, I'm not going to rat out anybody. It would be nice to use the, uh, the weapons presses, the uh, ammo press rather. Right. So I need to head back this way. Back to Medea's house, wherever that was. Why is this guy running from this other guy? Where was her house anyway? Move on, scab. Don't call me a scab, scum. in time. Asher has ordered everyone into the square. Rumor has it that he's going to open up the arena. That's perfect for us. Uh, Rena, before I go anywhere, you're going to explain this plan to me. <laughs> yeah. Simple, really. From time to time, Asher opens up the arena. Any slave who wants to can fight against the gladiators. Okay. If you win, you get your freedom. More importantly, you get an audience with Asher. It's the only way a slave will ever get to talk to him directly. You fight, you win, and when you talk to Asher, you take the cure. Uh, okay, and he'll just give it to me? Not exactly, no. Werner has a distraction planned. We haven't been making these weapons for nothing, you know. But okay. when you're meeting with Asher, you'll be close enough to grab the cure. Get it and bring it to me. Now let's get out there and listen to Asher's speech. 
There'll be hell to pay if the guards catch us in here. Okay. I have a feeling you need to quit I bring something. you good news. We stand at the dawn of a new golden age, where others merely survive. We thrive! And while I have led your efforts, it has been by your own strength that you have earned all the envy of the world. And most of all, they envy our victories in the struggle for freedom. Because yes, freedom is what we all and work so, towards. To celebrate this struggle, I ask my loyal workers, who among you is prepared to fight for your freedom? Me, I guess. Hello? Right here. We have one. This man here will fight in the hole. Come on, Asher. Will you send someone to the hole who actually stands a chance? Sir, Sir I don't you think carry you not only the dream that workers can become free, but that we may all someday become truly free from the threats dismissed. of our world. There's loads of people talking over this guy. You head down to the hole. Talk to Phaedra. She sets up the fights. Phaedra. Uh, I take it that's back at the mill, is it? <coughs> hmm. Question is, what weapons am I allowed to take into the? I mean, I'll do that. I've only got one stim pack, so I really need to find somebody that I can get some stuff off. Because otherwise, this is not going to go well. Oh, here we are. All right. <laughs> so you're the dumbass scab that signed up to fight in the hole, huh? That'd well, head on down. Phaedra's waiting for you. <laughs> Don't even want to. Know what that is. Okay. Let's head on down. What are you doing down here, slave? Don't tell wow. me your pale ass is gonna throw down. You look gorgeous. <laughs> uh, where do I sign up? You don't sign up. You tell me you want to fight, I set up a fight. You die, and I repeat it with the next jackass slave who comes in here. Not gonna happen. Though. Sound good? You want in? Come on, death's gotta be better than your life, am I right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, do I get any weapons? You have what you take in with you. But if Brilliant. that's not enough, there are a couple of things in that locker over there. Good. Uh, I want to fight in the arena. Oh yeah? You sure you're ready to die? Yeah, put me down for a fight. Well, all right. I've got one for you right away. Or you can take some time to put your affairs in order. <laughs> it's up to you. Who am I going to be fighting? We're going to throw you in there with a bunch of the other scabs who think they've got what it takes. You're all gonna fight it out, and the last one standing gets to move on. Probably won't be you, though. Okay, not yet. I'm not surprised. Not yet. Let's have a look what she's got. Mm. All right, we'll, we'll take that stuff. Is there anything else? Uh, right, let's take a look. Makes sense to go in with. The hunting rifle. Okay. You, you yeah, again. come on. 
Let's do it. If you're ready, just step on in. All right. They will fight. They will die. And all for you. All for your entertainment. How many are we dealing with here? Can I get my weapon ready, please? Oh, they're dropping the pup. All right. Let's get rid of you first. One down. Two down. Let's just grab what we can here. Mm, take it. Nice. Well, I don't want to take too many rads, so. Wow. Impressive, slave. Those were some of the toughest scabs around here. No, they weren't. You've got some fight in you, it seems. But I wouldn't get too excited. I'm sure asher has got something special planned for your next fight. Here's something for the rads. Enjoy it while you can. Come back when you're ready for your next fight. Okay. So let's... Um, take a rad away. Take a rad X. That makes sense, doesn't it? And then let's have a look at what we picked up. We've got some... Chinese assault rifles. Let's put that on one. Let's put the combat shotgun, excuse me, on two. Ooh. And the armor. So that's 12. I think the throwdown armor looks better. Where well, the red resistance would probably be better. All right, let's go with that. Okay. Let's do this. You again? Back for more, huh? Yep. I'm ready. I wouldn't count on luck this time. You damn well better be ready. I'm ready. Well, all right. That's what I like to hear. Get on in there. Let's find out if the newcomer can hold his own against real fighters. Release! Ooh, okay. Fight! Got a guy with a flamer. Let's go down. Whoa, no, no, no. Don't want to get hit by that. He's got a... Yeah, he's got the... Uh... Oh, what's it called? I will remember in a sec. But let's take that. Ooh. And I may as well take that as well because I can repair my armor then. Death Claw Gauntlet, that's what I was looking for. So look, Gamma Shield's probably better than Throwdown Armor. Am I right? I am right. So Death Claw Gauntlet is a fairly nice melee weapon. Doesn't look like it does much damage at the moment. That's because our melee skill is very low. But that actually destroys people if you're running a melee character. Not bad, Grinder. Weapons. Not bad. The Bear Brothers were some pretty mean sons of bitches. One more fight and you're free. But I wouldn't plan on making it through the next one. Here's a shot for the Rads. Come back when you're ready for your last fight. Let's just do it. Come on. You again? Yes, back me again. I'm ready. Let's do it. Well, all right, that's what I like to hear. Get on in there. And it probably makes also some sense to equip some grenades for a bit of extra damage. Now, this guy, I, if I recall, he's got a metal blaster or something. It's a like an energy weapon. Hits like a truck. 
Oh no, he hasn't. He's got an infiltrator. And that gun is actually kind of cool. Right, last one, gone. Nice. Taking your infiltrator, 100%. Don't wuss out on me now. Go. Excuse me? Get in there or die in Well now, aren't you quite the scrapper? Congratulations. Thanks. You've done well. Asher wishes to see you. The guards will be told to allow you to pass. Uh, where can I find him? He watches over the city from Haven. He's towering in uptown. Take the northeast exit from here and look for the tallest building in town. Oh. Asher also said that he has a few gifts for you. You'll find them in a container behind you. Enjoy. And don't keep the man waiting. I'm here. Either way, I don't care. Why is she telling me to go away? Well, there's nothing in that. Oh, does he mean this? Aha, it's all of my goodies. I'm wondering where they were. Right, let's uh, let's sort ourselves out first. First and foremost, right. Repair that. Repair that. Let's get that on one. Get that on six. Mm, not really bothered by the flamer. Gatling laser, gorse rifle, gauss if you like. Infiltrators take normal assault rifles, so that's good to know. Let's put the infiltrator on two. Jingwei shock sword. Put that on three. And nice. And then, don't want that. Let's put our winterized power armor back on. I don't need the slave suit or the raider throwdown. The neural interface suit particularly. And the gamma shield armor. Oh, although that's worth quite a bit, but it's also fairly heavy, actually. Right. This stuff. This. It's an assault rifle with a scope and a silencer built in. It is amazing. Probably should have done this DLC before one of the earlier ones, but never mind. Right, so Asher. We've got to go and find Asher. And of course, we're fully equipped now to potentially have gone back into the steel yard if we'd wanted to to find the rest of the steel bars uh, without a guide I don't think I'd ever find them all again to be fair I remember it taking years last time <laughs> well not years but you know what I mean uh, don't waste your breath boy ain't talk no, that's fine. I don't particularly want to talk to you either, but how do I get to this Asher chappy? Actually, let's consult the map. Oh, uh, okay. Gotta go to Pit. Up town. So back into the mill. Up town. Is along and up. Oh, 
Oh, maybe it was through this gated area over here with guys like, mm, yeah, you're not coming in. Yeah. Uh, oh. Right. Thanks. And then I take it. I just follow this, do I? Duke Mill Uptown. They're uh, shooting at bottles, bullets, Hungry. and things. You're the only one I've seen so far that doesn't look rancid. And a sniper rifle there. Uh, how far away am I from where I need to be? Take it, I go this way. It's a hideous looking thing over there. Right. Whoa. Save here. Uh, one of you, Ash. Here comes Speedy. Here comes Speedy. Is that what you're nicknaming me now? He's got his bitches up there. Who are you? Awfully twitchy, ain't you? Wouldn't you be? Let's just give it a little wiggity wig. Right with you. Feel free to wait inside. And I'm telling you, I've got it covered. And weirdly, look, right he's wearing maintain some order and dispense a little justice. Uh set of parama. Follow that up by raising the dead. No, but I may heal the infirm later in the week. Time permitting, of course. Sir, we've had sightings of Werner back in the city, and there's been an increase in chatter between slaves. Workers. What? We call them workers. Helps with morale. Reminds them that they might earn their freedom someday. Whatever we call them, they've been gathering makeshift weapons. All right, all right. Put your guards on alert. Tell them to be on the lookout for anyone loitering too long downtown. And keep a watch on Medea at all times. Anything big happens, it's bound to go through her. Now, I've got a very important meeting with our new friend. So if anything big comes up, you use the intercom. Yes, sir. Okay, break's over. Well, if it isn't our fearless champ. Nice work in the hole, New Blood. Knew you couldn't be one of our normal workers. So that begs the question, who are you? And what are you doing in my city? I heard the pit was building an army I'm here to join. It's complicated. How about we just say I'm new in town looking for work? No. I'm a hero who's going to kill you and free the slaves. Let's say the second one. I understand. We've all got a past, and damn few of us have reason to be proud of it. That's all behind you now. In the pit, you'll be part of a growing army, a thriving industry, and maybe even witness to a cure for radiation. Mm. But we aren't perfect, and sometimes the past comes back to haunt us. Tell me, do you know a man named Werner? Mm, I've heard of him. You know he's not to be trusted. He escaped after a failed coup, and I believe he's working with the slaves to plan a revolt. You said workers. You know the slaves, and you've workers. met Werner, so you're in a prime position to put 
an end to him. Do that, and I'll make you a lieutenant in my army. I don't want to be part of your army. Thanks, but I've got other plans. Ah, of course. Would these plans happen to involve stealing a precious little something from me? Don't look so surprised. Your arrival was too convenient. And even if you never met Werner, I'm sure he got someone to make you an offer. It's okay. I get a lot of people trying to betray me. Part of the position, really. You can be honest with me. He said your discovery will free the slaves and cure them. How could I say no? Easy enough. You could say no because he lied to you. My discovery is a miracle. But it isn't the type that sets slaves free. Now it would do a lot more good if you were to. Lord Asher, the slaves are rioting and someone's armed them. We need you out here and fast. Damn it, I'm on my way. I suggest you forget Werner's offer and consider mine. Stop, Werner, and you'll have a bright future in the pit. Don't disappoint me, Big Blood. Or what? Find the cure in his palace. Okay, well, he's he's gone, hasn't he? He's gone left, so let's go and take a look. Oh, I wasn't expecting Asher to let you into the lab. I'm Sandra, and if I know my husband, he's already made you an offer to join us, right? So you're here to see our little miracle, aren't you? This is my daughter Marie. She can be a handful, but my little angel is going to save the city. I don't care about your spawn. Where's the cure? Uh, uh, I've got a bad feeling this isn't just bring your daughter to work day. That's nice, but why do you have your daughter in your lab? Actually, it's a combination lab and nursery. Little Marie needs a lot of attention and care if she's going to cure the city. Wait, you mean she has a natural and transferable immunity of some sort? Well, this is a nice surprise. Apparently you and Asher are the only other people who know anything about science in this place. Yes, it seems that our daughter was born with a naturally acquired immunity to any form of mutation. It's nothing short of a miracle, honestly. I'm still trying to figure out why, but she may just hold the key to stopping the Pitt's trog problem. Hell, maybe other types of mutations too. Uh, aren't you worried about hurting Marie? Oh no, these tests are perfectly safe. In fact, between the crib and her uncanny health, she's probably the safest child in the world. Asher and I would never risk her health. And if that means it takes longer to develop a full cure, then, well, everyone else can wait. Is there anything I can do to help? Just let me know. You're a dear, but things are well in hand here. If you really want to help, you should probably go deal with whatever had Asher rushing off in such a hurry. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to take care of one last test before Marie's nap time. Yeah. Let's see what your research computer has. Hmm. Do you mind? No, no, no. no. Let's uh, just pretend I'm doing some good work here. Let's... Baby Marie is napping peacefully in her crib, safely connected to various medical monitors and wrapped in protective swaddling. It looks like moving her would not go over well with her family. Okay, well, we'll make that decision next time. Guys, we're going to pause it here for today. I really hope you've enjoyed this one. If you have, please do all those lovely social media things. Please like, comment, share, subscribe if you are new to the channel. And I will see you next time for more in our playthrough of Fallout 3, The Pit. And um, we'll decide what we're doing here. But until then, take care. Thanks for watching. And bye-bye for now.